Hi, boys and girls. Welcome back to the Parsha Studio. Shavuos is coming up this week, the holiday when we celebrate the giving of the Torah. In honor of that, we will make a Shavuos snow globe. Here are the supplies that we will need. A small plastic container with a cover, super glue, flower glitter, a toothpick, green and blue clay, water, and glycerin. Here we use vegetable glycerin. Let's begin. Create a mountain-like shape out of green clay, which will be the Harsinai. Make sure it fits inside the cover of the container. Meanwhile, I want to tell you a story. Once upon a time, a Jew moved to a new town and unfortunately, he could not stop finding problems with the community. He decided to go to his Rebbe for advice. He made the journey there and waited his turn to go in for an audience. Using blue clay, create two equally sized rectangular prisms, a 3D rectangle. These will be the luchos, so ensure that they are proportionate to the Harsinai. In other words, their size should make sense compared to the size of the mountain. When the man came into the Rebbe's room, before he could speak, the Rebbe asked, How are things going in your town? He began to pour out his heart, explaining all of the issues in his community. Next, use a toothpick to etch all of Bay's letters into the luchos. The actual luchos contains all of the words in the Aseris Hadibros. There isn't enough space on these tiny luchos to include all of that, but for this craft, it's okay to suffice with the first few letters of the olive base. If your container comes with a small insert inside the cover, make sure to take it out. It's time for some super glue, one of the stickiest glues you may have ever encountered. That being said, it would be best to ask an adult to help you with the step. Glue the mountain inside the cover, then stick the two luchos to each other side by side. Lastly, attach the two luchos to the mountain then set it aside. Next, pour your desired amount of glitter into the container. These tiny flower glittery pieces are Harsinai's flowers. Then add two to three teaspoons of glycerin or until a full layer covers the bottom, but not more. Mix the glitter and glycerin well. You can use a toothpick for this. When the man finished his explanation, the Rebbe looked at him and said, perhaps this is why you were sent to this town, to create a more positive environment and influence the community. Next, pour water into the container until it is almost full. Lastly, put on the cover, which will cause the Harsinai to become submerged. Close it as tightly as you can. You may even want to glue it shut with a bit of super glue. Hashem gave us the Torah in the middle of the desert, an ownerless place, to show that it doesn't belong to a specific country or place, but to every place. In doing so, He gave us the job of bringing Torah wherever we may go, like the Chassid in our story was told. Enjoy your Shavuot snow globe, shake it up, and watch the flowers settle onto the Harsinai. Have a wonderful Shavuot. Kabbalah Satora B'Simcha See you next week.